Prayer works because God works through prayer. Now, some of you, you're not tracking with me. You're like, Pastor Byron, that's really good, but I'm not there yet. Okay, let me give you three reasons why I believe that God loves it when we pray. I'm gonna give you three reasons that I believe that God loves it when we pray. Do you know, this is an invitation that Jesus is inviting you into his presence to come and to pray. And I wanna give you three reasons why God loves it when you pray. The first reason is this, because God loves to show off his greatness. Did you know that? That God loves to show off his greatness in your life. I remember one time when me and Ashley were living in Houston, I was unemployed. I had actually lost my job and I was in a transition period and I was praying and believing that God was gonna give me a new job. And so I'm like, God, where is this job at? You know, I just, I haven't gotten it, I've applied. Didn't get a job. I've done interviews. I didn't get a call back. Okay, God, it's been several weeks now, kind of running low on money. Need to get me a new job. And so after weeks and weeks and weeks of not getting a call back, I said, okay, God, here's what we're going to do. You're going to give me a job and I'm not going to apply for it. I'm not going to go out and seek it and find it. I don't even want to do an interview. God, you're just going to give me this job. And so I'm sitting at church the very next day and a girl walks up to me and she says, hey, do you need a job? And I was like, Yes. She said, that's great. I said, well, where do I apply? She said, you're hired. Come in Monday. You don't even have to fill out an application. You're hired. And I'm like, that's amazing. God answered my prayer. And so I go in and I start on Monday. And as the week goes on, I realize this isn't the job for me. <laughs> in fact, the, the owner of it was asking me to do unethical things, to lie and to steal from clients. And I was like, I'm not into this. And so after several different conversations and pushback, I go into work on Friday and they fire me. <laughs> so I got hired on a Monday and I got fired on a Friday. <laughs> and I remember riding my bicycle back home and I just remember thinking, okay, God, why would you answer this prayer so specifically and give me a job? And then I didn't even work five days before I get fired. God, why would you do this? And I heard the voice of the spirit as clear as day, just so you know that I can. Okay, God. Good answer. And then two weeks later, I was offered a job in my very first pastorate. Just so I can trust him. God loves to show off his greatness in your life. I have held on to that for over 10 years. Anytime money's tight, anytime I'm in a situation, anytime I need to see an answer of prayer, anytime me and my family are in a position where we have to depend and trust on God, here's what I just think over and over again. I remind myself, God told me, just so you know that I can. God loves to show off his greatness. The second reason is this. God loves to show off his goodness. Later, we're going to see that God is a father. That's how I want you to think about God. God is a father, and every dad wants to be good to his kids. I'm a dad. I got two daughters. My daughter, Esther's son, she is three years old. She could be four in like two weeks. And uh, the other morning, as I was getting ready to go to work, she was going to day school. And as I was walking out the door, kid you not, my daughter, Esther, she runs up to me. She says, Daddy, can I have an energy drink? <laughs> now, remember, my daughter's three. Now, do you think me, being the great dad that I am, is going to give my three-year-old daughter an energy drink? Actually, I did. <laughs> I gave my three-year-old daughter an energy drink. Now, she always sees me drinking energy drinks, but the truth is I didn't actually give her an energy drink. I gave her one of these. She thinks <clears throat> good to grow apple juice <laughs> is an energy drink. But every parent of toddlers knows that these things, it's just apple juice, cost more than energy drinks. It's like $4. Okay, it's a $4 apple juice. They're running a racket on parents, I guess. And so, and so I went to CVS and I got me an energy drink and I got her an energy drink. And we went and we sat out on the porch swing before I went to work and we drank our energy drinks together. Why would I do that? Because I want my daughter to know that I love her. And I'm the closest representation to God that my three-year-old little girl knows. And I want for my daughter to grow up believing that God is good. God loves it when you come and pray to him because God loves to show off his goodness in your life. And then number three, God loves to show others his glory. God loves it when you're in a situation where you don't know what to do. Now, I know you don't love it, but God loves it when you're in a situation where you have to depend on him. 
God loves it when you're in a season of life where you have to seek and knock and find him. God loves it whenever you're in circumstances where you're so desperate for him, where nothing's going to work and nothing's going to happen. And if God doesn't show up, then everything's going to fail. And you cry out to him and you call out to him. God loves it when you're in a situation where he's the only one who can get the credit. God loves to show off his glory to others through your life. God loves it when we pray. Listen, prayer works because God works through prayer. 